Hi everybody, it's Valerie. Just updating on my meditation progress. Yes, I did it this morning already and it went very well. I started originally with three minutes because I hadn't been consistent with my practice before and I wanted to make sure I could sit still for the entire thing. And then yesterday when the timer went off at three minutes, it seemed too short. So today I did five minutes. And what was really interesting, one thing that I teach and one thing that I do is when you're meditating, if thoughts come in, just sort of notice them and then let them go and then go back to concentrating on your breathing or noticing what your body is physically doing, your chest expanding or your shoulders moving or noticing the air going in and out of your nose. And so when the thought comes in, like I said, you just let it go. This time I had a thought that kept trying to interrupt me. And so instead of letting it go, I actually just concentrated on it for a few moments. And what was interesting is um, I actually found a solution to the idea that was just, hello, hello, and I solved it. And then as soon as that was done, I just went back to my breathing and it went very smoothly. And then when the timer went off at five minutes, it just seemed so fast. I should have gone longer. Tomorrow I'm gonna to go longer. But that was really interesting. Usually what I teach people is if you have a problem that you wanna solve, do that, think about it just as you're going to sleep. Think about it before you climb in bed and then think about it once you lay down. And what happens is the brainwave frequencies that you have as you're going to sleep, while you're sleeping, and then as you're waking up, those brainwave frequencies get to your subconscious and what's stored in there to help solve problems, that's where, that's where you need to be. Well, when you're meditating, that also gets you into a similar brainwave frequency. And I think that's why I was able to solve the issue that I was thinking about so quickly. So it's very interesting. Next time I think I have something that I wanna think about, I'll just set meditation practice with the intention of solving that problem and just concentrating directly on that. So that's it for my meditation today, but what I also wanted to share with you is um, a few weeks ago, before I knew I was doing this challenge, I signed up to do one 5K per month. There's an organization here in town called the Huntsman Senior Games, and it's for people 55 and over. And every year people come into town, it's like the Olympics for 55 and older. And it is a wonderful organization. They do tons of sports. Well, because of COVID, they haven't been able to do that. So they started a virtual 5K. And I thought that'll get me out of the house and walking in the beginning of the year. They're having one each month. So I signed up and they talked about getting medals, but I thought you would get a medal if you were one of the people that had a fast time. Well, yesterday in the mail, my medals showed up. They're really nice. It's called the Beast Series, and there's a different animal for each month. And I can't remember which month is which, but here is the eagle. It's beautiful. Well, these things are heavy. And the other one is a shark. And the other one so far, so I signed up for three months because they didn't have anything scheduled after that. This last one is a lion. So now I gotta get out there and walk. <laughs> so yes, I did my meditation. I will go do some walking again today, further than the mailbox, and I'll let you know how that's going to. So talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, I forgot to tell you, um, the background. Last time I had the castle in my background. Today, I found this at an art show one time, the art fest that they have in Henderson, Nevada. And when I saw it, I fell in love with it. And this happens to be the patio at the Ritz Carlton in Laguna Niguel. And one time when I was on vacation driving from San Diego up to Newport Beach to visit a friend, I actually stopped at that hotel and got to go out there and 
see the patio and just see the beauty. So this always makes me smile when I see it. So I thought I would just share that with you. So I'll talk to you later. Bye.